I recently heard of soft life, and I originally didn't know what it was. But what I realized is that I've been living a soft life since 2017. So outside of the luxury, the money, soft life to me is healing. It's allowing yourself to have grace, allowing yourself to be who you are without a mask. And when I started to go to therapy in 2017, I learned how to take off the mask. I got to the root of why I even felt like I needed a mask to cover who I truly was. I stopped beating up on myself and I understood why I felt like I had the desire to beat up on myself. And so when I think of soft life, it's being gentle with who you are, allowing you to be, allowing you to heal, allowing you to understand, allowing you to grow. And I think I gave up the idea of being just a strong woman a long time ago because being strong and working and overachieving wasn't healthy, but that came from a place of lack. And I allowed myself to live in the moment. I allowed myself to choose me. I allowed myself to say no. And I think when I made that decision, the wealth started to come. The love started to come. The happiness started to come. But I had to make a decision to choose Ashley and also to be open. Because it's very hard for you to be open and honest and open your heart to people, to relationships. And when I got tired of blocking my heart and hiding who I was in my core, and I recognized that it was daunting wearing that mask. It was daunting being strong. And that was a perception that I gave myself that I had to let go of. And I think when I let go of the idea of being something that I thought I had to be and started to choose who I wanted to be, I had a soft life.